Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be going over part three of the Build a Suggestion Box app project on Trailhead. So for this part three, we're going to be modifying the user experience, which we're going to modify the page layout, which is where you see all your different fields. And we will be creating a global action to create a suggestion from different areas in Salesforce. So let's go ahead and jump into our Trailhead org. So here we are in our suggestion box app. Let's see a few different suggestions that we've made. Don't know if those will happen, but we're going to go into our setup. So we click the gear icon and set up. And then we're going to go to the object manager go to our new suggestion object. From here, we're going to go to page layouts and we're going to edit our page layout. Okay, and let's see what are we going to move. Looks like we are going to go to suggestion detail. So here we are at suggestion detail and we're going to move status underneath owner on this other side and we're going to do some more thing with our implemented date so we're going to move it over and then we're going to quick save so that'll keep us here on the same page all right and now we're going to do add another section just below information and this is going to be description. Make sure you spelt it right. It looks like I did not. It's going to be a one column. Click OK. And we're going to add a suggestion description down here. And then we're going to click save. And this will take us out of the page layout editor. Awesome. From here, we're going to go to home and then go to, we're back to, actually, nope, I was right. We're going to go to just the setup and go to global actions. And we're going to do a new action. Action type, we're going to create a record. It'll be on the suggestion object. Standard label is going to be new record. And name will be new suggestion. And click save. All right, from here, we are on the page layout for a global action. And it looks like we are going to add suggestion category down here and a suggestion description down there. Click Save. Next, we're going to go to the predefined actions and click New. or the predefined field of values, excuse me. And then for status, the pick list value is going to be new. So whenever we enter a new record, it's going to automatically have a status of new. So click save. 
All right, and now we're gonna go to Publisher Layouts. So it should just be right here underneath Global Actions. And we're gonna edit the global layout. So the layout that's for the whole org. And for this mobile and lightning, we're gonna override the pre, the, the predefined actions. So we're going to add new suggestion from the mobile, so not the quick actions, but the mobile actions. We're gonna add new suggestion. And we're gonna have it be after post. And then click save. All right, and you can either try this out and look at it, or we can go back to our trailhead and we can verify. And there you have it. We have another 100 easy points. Be sure to like and subscribe. Uh, it really helps out my channel and helps me create more helpful videos like this. And I'll catch you guys in part four.